is. Not that I'm gonna. Drakes are where it's at. Keep out. Well, clearly that means everyone else, not me. Hmm, or maybe it does mean me. Like the ruins outside, this building remains intact and inhabited. A network of charred pylons crisscrosses this hall, protecting the privacy of the inhabitant. A pile of charred bones show how serious these defenses are. Look for some clue as to who lives here, but you see nothing but the machinery. You can't hear anything about the soft crackling of the machinery. Well, that did something, but I have no idea what. Turned off that guy? Can I just... No. I cannot walk straight through the middle there. I have to go back around. Guys! Oh, it doesn't affect you. Still. Just because I load the game doesn't give you free reign to just waltz wherever you please. You can just stay there and get electrolysis. Grounded robe, coated cloak, trapped box. Sage. I try to open this trapped box. Maybe it's poison. Which would still be pretty fatal, but not. Nope. Just straight damage. Yes, yes, yes. If it's poison, you might be able to just chug enough curing pods to uh, save your skin. If it's acid, you probably won't have time. If it's straight damage, you're probably dead. Research notes. Another trapped chest. Canister. Hey, guy. Meet the lone residents of this isolated workshop. Puts great faith in his defenses. Doesn't even notice when you enter. He's too absorbed in spell he's casting. You look at his hands. You see the essence flowing from them, slowly coalescing into a small artila. As the creature begins to come to life, something goes wrong. Cracks appear in the little creature's skin. The man swears and waves his hand. As the artila dissolves, the man notices you. He looks at you, and the horrified look on his face immediately tells you something. He was shaping, but he is no shaper. He stammers. What are you doing here, trespasser? I am Sage Ophelia, and this is my home. I don't know what you thought you saw, but I assure you that it is best kept among us. Uh... This would be a good opportunity to get more rebel, uh, rebel reputation, or at least uh, anti-shaper reputation. Three? Rebels improved. I'm glad to hear it. If that fool up in Fort Vengeance learned what I was doing, he shakes his head. It's good to have like-minded company. I've been alone since, almost since the beginning of the rebellion, carrying on my studies in secret. 
Can you teach me some of what you've learned? Oh, hey, he learnt teaches Create Drac too, and Rotgroff, and Glack, and Battle Alpha, and frickin' Kaishak. He's more expensive than the other place, though, but hey. What's this workshop for? Gorman says, The Pleasure of the Shapers. Guardian Ginslin, up in Fort Vengeance, has commandeered this place. When the Rebellion came west, he was... Uh, it was where I did my work. Uh, then I had to breed and assemble mines and pylons for him instead. Fortunately, he leaves me alone as long as I meet my quotas for supplies. I get to keep my privacy. I value it greatly, as you have seen. The Shapers just took over your workshop? They are Shapers. That is what they do. I understand that I am paid very well for my time and labor, but it still remains at their command. You can make pylons? He wasted the half-completed pylon on a nearby platform. Someone has to. There aren't enough shapers to make them from mere essence. I breed the creatures within and make the shells and assemble the final product. Do the Kaishaks bother you? Not at all. In fact, they do an excellent job of keeping intruders away. They avoid the soldiers who come down the hill to collect my goods. Suits me well. Uh, how'd you learn to shape? Weighs heavily whether he should say anything or not. A desire to share the details about his years of solita solitary labor overwhelms his caution. The Shapers pay me very well for my work here. For centuries, they have controlled their secrets. However, in this time of rebellion, their grasp has grown weak. There are many tomes and textbooks floating around for the person who knows who to bribe. Don't you have any creations around that offend you? Uh... That's because the moment the troops from Fort Vengeance arrived and saw them, I would be killed. But they could defend you, and you could turn the pylons loose on them. Why didn't you become a shaper the normal way? I tried. I was smart enough, however, I was not suitably mindlessly loyal to the shaper ideology, and that was the end of it. I'm surprised they didn't kill you afterwards, honestly. Eh... Shaper documents? Not at this point. I already have more books than I understand. Only when I have mastered them will I know what path I want to follow. Okay. Well, there's another place where I can learn to create... Or, yeah, create... Ah! I forgot that was there. <laughs> Let's go through his conversation options again. There we go. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Phew. Crap. <laughs> Walk around the corner like eight Kai Shack just sitting there. Chilling out, having a party. I should probably exit this area. I can sort of handle it, but I can also sort of not handle it, and it's just unpleasant. Rude. Give me a break. Good grief. It's frickin' ridiculous. Magic Kaishak and his never-airing lightning bolts. 
Man. Cast it already. Of course, he doesn't bother me this time. Now that I'm suitably defended, he doesn't care. Okay, that goes to the farmland. We could check out the Western Pass again, but it'll probably end in my death. So instead... Well, actually, I was trying to get some money. Yes, we already read this. I don't remember what killed me over here. Hey, guys! Savage cryoras, huh? Oh no, it's an orc. It's a battle orc. Actually, I forgot I had that spell. Hey, knock it off. To jerks. More cryora. Huh, I lost my combat spell. Hey, knock it off. <laughs> Take that. Probably get some more pissed off at me then. Uh, Vlish. Whatever Vlish's name is. I can't remember their names. Maxwell, Theodore, Gregory. That's right. Is the battery dying in my mouse? Can we just cooperate? Mouse is teleporting. It's very awkward and annoying. And Cryora skin grieves. Cold resistance. They weigh seven pounds, which I'm already encumbered. Ooh, thirsting knife. Plus two strength, plus one dexterity. It's an upgrade. Because it doesn't take away from my own personal dexterity. Hey. 
Hey guys. Jeez. These guys are pretty tough. But he's dead. 200 health. That'll learn ya. Looks like there's also a stat boosting thing here. Nope, just a shape to build. I thought it was like a girdle of might or something. At the low end of the valley that passes through the mountains to the west, there is a large gateway blocking the path, defended by a large chain of huge mines, some of the largest you've ever seen. Very dangerous. The, mines have, the way the mines have been placed is very interesting. Looks like they are positioned to keep people inside the storm plains, not out. General Alwyn wants to make it clear that no matter how bad things get in this province, there is no retreat, no escape. The only options are stopping the rebel advance or death. Dip, or having like a billion hit points so you can get through that mess. Because uh, that is not a path you're going to be able to traverse. Mines and triggers here recently bred and waiting to be placed along roads. Not active. Gates are closed without cancel permission. Dangerous rogue infestation. Stay away. Face the road up to the pass of the north, there are numerous creation tracks in the ground. However, the creatures that left them are far larger than the rogues down below. You see signs of frequent and recent skirmishes on this road. Some firepower has been brought to bear to dislodge the rogues ahead. So far, it hasn't worked. Is that just an Artila? Of course, it could be like an Inferno Worm or something. Those are unpleasant, to say the least. Nope, that's a charged artillery. It probably breathes lightning or something. Do 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 shoot. Hey, guy. I don't like you. Well, it cursed him. Didn't actually hurt him at all. Okay, that's not a good option. That's also not really a good option. Cold is a good option. Okay, get in here, smack it. Oh no! Jeez. Not a fan of you. Rah, smack.